Hello friends, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. In this session, let us look at this interesting question for competitive exams. Two candles of the same height are lighted at the same time. So we have two candles of different thickness. The first is consumed in six hours. That means you just light it up. It will take six hours to completely get burned. Whereas the second one takes four hours. Obviously the thickness is less. So it will take very less time when compared to the first one. Assuming that each candle burns at a constant rate, in how many hours after being lighted was the first candle twice the height of the second? How many hours after being lighted was the first candle twice the height of the second? So let's try to understand this question now. So let us say that these two are the candles we have. And we just let us lit the candle now. Let us say we have lit the candle. Now we have to find out after how much time the first candle height will be the twice the second candle height. So let us say that we started, we lit this candle. So after let us say t hours it will take when the condition will be satisfied. So I will say that this much height is burned so the new height will be this much in the second case let us say that this much height is gone in t hours so this is the height so let's put that what is gone so this is gone in t hours similarly this is gone in t hours so what what we have been asked we have to find out after how much time the first candle height will be twice the second handle height so this height is twice the second height let me recap that we have been told that two candles of the same height are lighted at the same time so total height of both the candles are same first is consumed in six hours second is consumed in four hours so we are saying that we have to find out the time after at which how many hours or after how many hours or in how many hours the first candle height will be second twice the second handle height so we are saying that let us say that is t hours so in t hours in the first candle this much height is burned whereas in the second candle this much height is gone so if we are able to find out these two heights then we know the total height we can apply the condition so let's go ahead and do that in the case of first candle we know that if i take height here and the time we know that for height h the time taken is 6 hours now in t hours how much candle height is burned we can do cross multiplication and we can find out that is ht by 6 so this is ht by 6 so what is left out here now this is nothing but h minus ht divided by 6 because total is height is h similarly when i go to the second case in the second case same logic i can apply i know that for height h it takes 4 hours for t hours how much height that's nothing but h into t divided by 4 so h t by 4 height is gone so left out is how much nothing but h minus h t divided by 4 now what we have been told we have been told that after this time after this many hours t hours the first candle height is twice the second candle height the first candle height is twice the second candle height so we can write that condition we can say that therefore h minus h minus ht by 6 is equal to twice the second candle height that is 2 into h minus ht by 4 now i can cancel h throughout because h is there i can write down 1 minus t by 6 is equal to 2 minus 2t by 4 because i can cancel h 
I can take out H everywhere. H, H, H gone. So, what is left out now? This is nothing but 2 will go 2 times. So, can I say T by 2 minus T by 6 is equal to 2 minus 1. That is nothing but if you simplify, you get uh, we get 3 t by 6 minus t by 6 that is nothing but 2 t by 6 or can I say t by 3 equal to 1 which tells me t equal to 3 hours. So, after 3 hours after 3 hours the first candle height will be twice the second candle height. So, let us summarize how we did this. Two candles of same height are lighted at the same time. The first is consumed in 6 hours. The second is consumed in 4 hours. Assuming that each candle burns at, the con at a constant rate, in how many hours after being lighted was the first candle twice the height of the second candle. So, what we are saying now? We are saying that let us say after t hours, after t hours, the candle height, first candle height is twice the second candle height. So, we have to find out in t hours how much candle height is burned or how much height of the candle is gone. So, we know that because we know it takes 6 hours to burn the candle completely. So, in t hours, it will burn the height of h into t by 6. Similarly, here h t by 4, h t by 6, h t by 4. If I subtract from the total height, then I will have the rest height that is h minus h t by 6 here h minus h t by 4. Now, we know that this height is twice the second candle height. So, I can apply that condition h minus h t by 6 equal to 2 into h minus h t by 4. I can cancel h throughout. I have 1 minus t by 6 equal to 2 minus t by 2. You just simplify, you get t equal to 3 hours. So, that is one problem which I thought of sharing with you. So, thanks for your time and support.